Some of you might remember a little while ago I had done um, a video with some uh, digital thermometers and hydrometers that were all over the place. They were obviously faulty, and uh, there was they got they were advertised as an accuracy of um, one degree on the temperature scale, but uh, they weren't. They were as much as ten degree out in some some points, weren't they? And one of the hydrometers was completely wrong. Um, the people I bought them from either was going to give me a refund or send me some more. So I said, well, I, I did. I do need them. So if you're one hundred percent sure that the new ones will be accurate. Um, then I'll just have some new ones, please, just have replacements. So they sent me some replacements. They arrived today. On Christmas Eve they arrived, believe it or not. Yes, today is Christmas Eve. And they arrived today. Now, the thing that strikes me what's different is the other ones came in packaging. Um, you know, like uh, plastic packaging where you had to open, like manufacturer's packaging. But these ones are just wrapped up in some um, foam. Um, that's it. So it suggests to me that they've had them out of the packaging and tested them. Um, so hopefully they've tested them and these are going to be alright. All, all um, and uh, they should work. But there's only one way to find out. I've got to change the battery pack on the camera. Damn it. Well, there we go. I didn't bother changing the battery pack, I just plugged it in. Anyway, only one way to find out, isn't there? We have to take them out of packaging and give them a test. So. I've got my other trusty unboxing knife just to get rid of the sellotape. My real unboxing knife is in the in the garage where it belongs. Right, well they've still got the packaging, the uh, film on the front, so maybe they haven't tested them, I don't know, maybe they're just in different packaging. But the other ones were definitely in um, plastic packs individually wrapped individual they were um, so I don't know what's happened here they might have tested them with the film still on who knows if they, even if they have tested them <coughs> so I'm gonna have to find myself some batteries because obviously they take um, AAA batteries one each so what I'll do is I'll nick the batteries out of the other ones, out of the 40 ones, and see whether these ones are going to be any better. So that's what I'll go and do now. Ready for a jump cut. Right, here we are. New ones, old ones. Look what's happened to that one. It's been sat in the garage for a week. What's happened there then? <laughs> These ones are working alright, 88, 90, 93% humidity on this one, what ridiculous. Right, let's take the batteries out, stick the batteries in the new ones, and see how we go from there. Right then, literally just put all the batteries in now, in the new ones, let's take off this um, protective film. So, on number one, we got 18.5 degrees, 75% humidity so far. It's obviously got to adjust. I've only just put the batteries in. And this one we've got 17.6 and 77% humidity. Like I said, still got to do a little bit of adjusting though, haven't they? Let's have a look. Oh, what am I taking the battery thing off for? I'm going mad. I'm going loopy. It's Christmas Eve, my friend. What can I say? We love a Christmas Eve. I don't know what the time is on a Christmas Eve, but... It is Christmas Eve. Probably about 10 o'clock, I would have thought. Right then, so already without the adjustment, without it settling, we've got 17.9, 19, 17.8 and 15.5 degrees. I'm coming to the conclusion these are just total rubbish. But we'll leave them there to settle, um, to get used to the, the uh, ambient temperature in this conservatory and uh, We'll see what happens once they've settled down a little bit. Well, they've been there for about an hour now, and they've all settled down. We've got 19.1, 19.3, 19.1, and 19.4. I think that's pretty much within the tolerances of what they should be 63%, 65%, 67%, and 67% humidity. That's probably within the tolerances. 
and I've got this next model up one which is 19.2 degrees and 69 percent so that's probably also within tolerances so at least the new ones are all good and dandy